Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another ToyHacks.com sponsored review. But before I get started, I need you guys to do me a favor. If you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously. Now, on to the decals. And the set we're looking at in this video is for Studio Series 86 Grimlock with Wheelie. And this decal set includes six decal sheets on a combination of foil and vinyl backing. So now, without further ado, let's take a look at Grimlock and Wheelie both before and after Toy Hacks decals. And welcome to Patriot Prime Reviews. In robot mode, straight out of the packaging, Grimlock looks awesome and very G1 accurate. Taking a closer look at the figure, He's got great paint applications there for the eyes, great paint applications there for the chest that's very reminiscent of the G1 toy. One issue I have is he does have a red Autobot logo hid in behind this translucent smoky plastic, so you really can't see the logo. Now, I had a Toy Hacks decal on top of this, so you do see a little bit of residue, but all of this is going to get covered up with the new set. Moving on down, still great paint applications there for the claws on the wrists. Uh, down here on the legs, you got blue, red, and green, which is very reminiscent to the G1 animation model. And really, that's about it. A little bit of uh, there's Autobot logo there on the wings, which is the dinosaur's chest. But that is about it for paint applications for Grimlock's robot mode. So there you have one final look at Grimlock in robot mode before and after and grimlock here gets quite a few new decals to help enhance his robot mode and the first decal you're probably noticing is the new decal right there on his chest now you do have a few different options for this you have this yellow cartoon style decal that i chose you also have a gold foil decal and i was i mean i was up in the air on which one of these I wanted to try out. But the problem with the gold foil, if you can see, it shows fingerprints and smudges. So that's why I didn't apply that. Now, of course, if you don't like either one of these decals, you could also do what I did before I even got this decal set, was I just took a Toy Hacks Autobot logo, which you have right there, and just slapped it over his translucent chest. So there are options for you. I wanted to try out the cartoon chest. I do like the looks of it. I think it looks really, really neat, though may not be perfect for this particular version of Grimlock, but it does make his chest stand out. Now, he also gets brand new decals for the eyes. Nice, shiny blue. Once again, you do get options where you can choose red. Let's see, where is it? Right there, just like the Generation 1 toy. He also gets new decals right there for the mouth plate that kind of wraps around right there. New decals here for the top of the shoulders. New decals right there on the front of the shoulders. The sides of the shoulders get these nice yellow decals, which really break up all that gray. Moving on down once again to the chest, you got some decals right there. Decals here on the underwear area, as I call it. New decals right here on the forearms and some gold decals right there on the claws that we'll see once again in dinosaur mode. There are purple decals there on the thighs. New decals right here on the blue sections. Decals on the black sections and decals there on the green. And he also has new decals for the toes. On the inside of the wings, he's got red stripes that go all the way across to break up all that gray and let's see side of the legs new decals right there that kind of have a blue window and there are decals right there 
on the sides of the legs. Now, I did notice on Toy Hacks's website that the sticker map shows this decal right here. You've got decals for both of these sections. You only get enough decals for two. So we are missing a couple decals. So that might have just been an issue on their site. So there you go, guys. There's one final look at Grimlock in robot mode after. In T-Rex mode, straight out of the packaging, Grimlock once again looks very cartoon accurate. Taking a closer look at this mode, he's got great paint applications there in the eyes. Nice gold there on the neck. Red stripe around his chest. You got the Autobot logo right there dead center. Of course, right here is the robot chest. That's the gold and translucent plastic. And then he has the gold claws down on the feet. Behind the dinosaur on the tail, you got the green, red, and blue paint applications once again. And of course, there's the black that was on the toes in robot mode. So not a bad looking dinosaur mode, but he does need something to make him pop just a little bit more. So there you have one final look at Grimlock in T-Rex mode before. And after. Now Grimlock gets a few decals to help enhance his T-Rex mode that's not seen in robot mode. The first decals you may be noticing are the new chrome teeth. And I love that. There are enough chrome decals to go all the way around. And if you happen to have a third-party upgrade set, which gives Grimlock front dentures, you can cut some triangles out of the scraps to make those fit quite nicely. Those teeth are from JRC Designs. I also have a sword from him that really help enhance Grimlock's robot mode even further. But going on over the decals in dinosaur mode, he also gets a new decal for the eyes. You got blue decals or you could pick red decals just like the generation one toy now right here this is kind of funny it look, looks like a zit but they give you an optional decal for grimlock's snout for when wheelie shot him with the slingshot on to the chest of grimlock you get new decals that go around the autobot logo and red decals right there on the side of grimlock's chest you get new decals right here here and three little yellow dots of course that goes on both sides for grimlock's stomach you can see the chest as well all the arm decals from robot mode carry over for the legs in dinosaur mode and of course there is the gold claws on the back of grimlock he has blue stripes right there on the back and of course the same decals you saw earlier in robot mode for the legs now forms the tail so there you go guys there you have grimlock in t-rex mode after and now let's take a quick look at wheelie wheelie is just this accessory that grimlock comes with decent enough paint applications though if you take a closer look at the head there nice paint applications for the face he's got blue eyes silver face you got the kind of peach look right there for the chest with the red autobot logo and of course down here on the legs pretty good paint applications as well now wheelie here only gets three decals he gets a peach decal right there for the crotch and these baby blue decals if i can find them again which are right here that go on the knees so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and show you guys a third party accessory that I got for my wheelie that gives him better legs. Let me get these out of the baggie. So the little blue decals go on his kneecaps and I'm going to see if they will fit on the kneecaps for whoops, these legs right here and we'll show wheelie off. So there you got one final look at wheelie before and after so here we have wheelie with his three new decals and his brand new legs now these were made for me by my buddy firetox and i'll put a link to his facebook page and etsy store in the description of this video so wheelie does look a lot better now and can at least stand up the toy hacks decal set for studio series 86 grimlock and wheelie 
is a great set. I love all the fine details that are now added to the figure, which really break up all of the gray that he had. The chest decal, as I said, I'm kind of tore on. In a way, I like it, and in a way, I don't. But still, it's awesome that you do have all the choices you have to really tweak this figure to make it your own. Dinosaur mode looks great. I love the chrome teeth. So this Toy Hacks decal set, along with third-party upgrades like from Firetox and JRC Designs, can really make your Grimlock pop. Now guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews. Once again, this is Patriot Prime, signing out. Hooah!